Hey, what is up guys? So Rakuten Trade just released their US dollar currency account that allows you to hold an unlimited amount of US dollar in your account as opposed to Malaysian Ringgit only previously. And this is a huge upgrade if you trade US stock with them. I've given it a quick test and it seems like the conversion fee Although it seems free of charge on the surface, they actually bake in about 0.55% of conversion spread. But of course, that is just from my one-time testing. Let me know in the comments down below if you get lower or higher spread than me. I'm sure it will be helpful to the other viewers as well. And what that also means is you can now save a ton of money from not having to convert your ringgit to US dollar for every buy and sell and buy and sell. Let me show you what I mean. You see, on the left hand side, before this, when you want to buy, say, Apple stock, you have to pay in ringgit, so you are charged once on the ringgit to US dollar conversion because Apple is traded in US dollar. And then when you want to sell it, you have to pay another conversion fee to sell Apple and get ringgit in return. And that cycle repeats every single time you buy new stocks like Amazon, Tesla, Google, Nvidia you name it but now all you have to do is just buy us dollar by converting your ringgit once and you get charged once and then you will have that us dollar cash sitting in your rakuten trade account you can now use them to trade whatever stock you want 10 or 20 or 100 times there will be no more conversion fee until you choose to cash out to your ringgit account for Busan Malaysia trading or just withdraw to your Malaysian bank account then you can sell your US dollar for ringgit so hopefully this diagram and my explanation makes sense for why this US dollar currency account feature is such a game changer for all Rakuten trade users if you don't have a Rakuten trade account yet feel free to use my affiliate link down below to immediately get free 1000 RT points which is essentially 10 ringgit in brokerage fee waiver plus some other perks here and there and also a chance to enroll yourself in some of their campaigns to win free shares and whatnot. Let me quickly show you how to use the feature in case you missed it. I will start with the web portal. Log into your account and you should be able to see your ringgit and US dollar balance. Now just click into this small button that shows a dollar sign which will land you at the currency exchange page. Choose your currency to convert. In this case, we want US dollar. So convert from MYR, then convert to US dollar. Amount to convert, this will be in ringgit, up to you of course. For this demo, I will try with 100 ringgit. Then enter your trading pin and click confirm. It will ask you to confirm your order, check the rate. You can always compare it with Google and see how much you are paying in terms of the spread. Then click convert. And that's all, conversion successful in a split second. You should now be able to see that US dollar balance in your account. And just to quickly jump back to the 0.55% conversion rate, in case you're wondering, there are comparables like Momo is around 0.33%, Interactive Brokers is around 0.1-ish percent, although they say spot rate, WISE is about 0.4 to 0.6%, so 0.5-ish percent for Rakuten Trade. I think that is still pretty decent. So over on your iSpeed mobile app, it's actually the exact same steps as well. Go to the My Account tab and click on this white button with the dollar sign. Over here, same steps, convert from MYR and convert to US dollar. The amount to convert will be whatever you want. In this case, I will test it again with 100 ringgit. Then when you are done, enter your 6 digit trading pin, then click confirm. Now you are at the confirmation page, double check it, then click convert. And you should see conversion successful. And now at your my account tab, you should be able to see the US dollar amount in blue color right now. So before we call it a day, let me quickly show you how to buy US stocks using your US dollar cash. At the order tab, key in any US stocks you want. In this case, I will just try it out with Shopify with the ticker symbol SHOP, then search for it. You will enter your buy order tab. Don't be intimidated by it, it's actually very, very simple. Account that will be my main cash upfront account. Currency, change this to US dollar in the drop down menu because remember, we want to buy US stocks with US dollar so that we don't need to convert any currency at this point. Price, this is the buy price per share for the stock you want. In this case, say I want to buy Shopify at $33.29 per share. Quantity, that would be one since I can only buy one share here. And validity, I would prefer day as opposed to GT day, good today. 
which I have mentioned before in my previous Rakuten trade tutorial so feel free to check that out. Enter your trading pin, feel free to check or uncheck these boxes, I just leave it like that, then click confirm. Double check your order again and when you are happy with it, click the red button execute and that is all. You have now successfully placed a buy order for the US stock that you want to buy. In this case, it's Shopify for me. Alright, that is all for this video. Hopefully you found it useful. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already because I have more personal finance and investment content coming up for you. Thanks for watching and as usual, I will see you in the next one.